Hi, I'm Zhipeng from Intel Labs. Today, I would like to introduce our new research for panoramic scene generation. The core of our method is a diffusion-based framework that can generate 360-degree panoramic scene from a single image. Leveraging conditional diffusion models, one can extend our method to generate panoramic scenes from anything. These include a piece of text that describes the scene, a simple hand drawing, and so on. After obtaining the panoramic image, one can leverage matured computer vision packages to render immersive videos or obtain 3D point clouds of the scene. Different works have been proposed to solve the panorama generation problem. One important type of methods leverage 2D diffusion models to generate multiple perspective views of the panorama. However, these methods lack mechanisms to infer the 360 degree layout. If no description is provided as the input prompt, they are likely to generate artifacted outputs. If a uniform description is provided, they are likely to generate redundant objects, such as multiple beds in a bedroom, which is non-ideal. Another line of research treats the panorama as a single equirectangular image and generated in one shot. However, the inherent drawback of the equirectangular representation makes these methods hard to close the 360 degree loop, resulting in a sharp boundary in the middle of the panorama. In addition, Due to the limited data, these methods have limited generation quality and some of them only accept text as the input. To address these problems, we propose a new method that can accept various types of inputs, smoothly close the 360 degree loop, and generate coherent and diverse scene layouts. To handle arbitrary input modalities, our method leverages matured conditional diffusion models to generate a perspective image if the input is not already one. Then our method performs iterative warping and inpainting. The warping step warps existing views to a novel view, where the black region represents the missing pixels. The inpainting step leverages pre-trained diffusion inpainting models to complete the missing pixels. To ensure the coherence of the scene layout, we leverage pre-trained language models to control what to generate in each view. Finally, our method merges multiple perspective views into the final panorama. Smooth fusion and super resolution are proposed to ensure the quality and resolution of the panorama. Since both the diffusion and language models are pre-trained without fine-tuning, our method can effectively preserve the zero-shot performance. Leveraging language models to control diffusion models, our method can automatically avoid generating redundant objects when needed, and detect and correct unsatisfactory diffusion outputs. In the experiment, our method outperformed state-of-the-art methods in both image-to-panorama and text-to-panorama tasks. Stable Diffusion V2 treats the panorama as a single equirectangular image, which cannot smoothly close the 360 degree loop. Text to room and MV diffusion have no mechanism to automatically infer the 360 degree scene layout in multiple views, resulting in repeated beds in a single bedroom. Our method utilizes language models to control diffusion models, making it possible to automatically generate panoramic scenes with high perspective rendering quality and reasonable 360 degree layouts. Similar to the previous sample, Stable Diffusion V2 shows a sharp boundary on the loop closure point.
Duplicated statues are created by perspective inpainting baselines, which are effectively avoided in our method. Due to the limited training data, text to light and LDM 3D may produce outputs that do not satisfy the input description, such as a non-modern room when asked for a modern one. In the meantime, these methods cannot smoothly close the 360 degree loop, similar to the stable diffusion V2 model. Combining with conditional diffusion models, our method can effectively generate panoramas from inputs beyond a single image, such as text descriptions. Beyond just the natural image and the text descriptions, our method can also generate panoramas from other input modalities, such as a depth map, a sketch drawing, or a color script, and so on. As an extra bonus, combining our method with the depth-based warping, we can generate immersive videos with both camera rotations and translations on diverse scenes. Applying depth estimation on the output panorama also allows us to create 3D point clouds of various scenes. Interestingly, we can even create underwater scenes with the reasonable geometry on the fish and the coral reefs. Our source code is fully compatible with the Intel Gaudi 2 AI Accelerator. The live demo has been featured at ISC HPC conference and will be available also on the CDPR demo event. Feel free to drop by and try it out. Beyond the ChatGPT language model, we have also supported Llama 3 in the framework. Check out our project page for more details and feel free to try our code and give us a star if you find it useful. Thanks.